Hello everybody and welcome back for another video and today we are going for something special for at least for me because uh, we will be checking out Dragon Age 4. This game or this series is coming with me like from from way way back and I remember the the first Dragon Age release and it was absolutely like smashing everything. It was just so so good. And I have to tell you uh, today we will be checking out the trailer and we will be checking out the, the premiere of the gameplay uh, reveal and uh, I have to say that I, I already saw the trailer and uh, yeah but I didn't see any of the gameplay and I'm so so like <laughs> uh, what can I say about this I'm cautious and uh, because the trailer was like yeah it's going way different way than all three predecessors I don't know what to think about it I'm like uh, still cautious cautious because we haven't seen gameplay so uh, trailer is one thing gameplay is something else so I don't know where to go but let's go check it out trailer first and then we will talk about it real quick and then we will jump right uh, right into the uh, gameplay reveal and yeah we will go from there so let's go and check it out Bioware. Alright, so fam familiar faces from Pedestas games. This will take more than you and me. But right from the get-go, uh, the tone of the game is like light-hearted, kinda. That's way different than the uh, than predecessors because it was dark. It was heavy and dark. And the daylight. Well, we'll see. We will see. Like, I don't mind the visuals. Like, uh, it's cartoonish, kinda. I don't mind that. I like stylized graphics. But when you get the package from before, it's it's really, really tough to go for something else. Nice. Warden. So we got a uh, different companions. Those are the companions we will be able to play with. Right. All right, dragon. With fire in their blood. She, she got a piercing here as a heart. What the hell? This crew needs a leader. Someone we can count on. Someone that the world can count on. Gonna find her. All right, and uh, we got our hero together. Defy the gods. Dragon Age, the Well Guard coming fall twenty four. That's really, really coming close. And yeah, gameplay reveal. It's a premiere right now, so uh, so we will go check it out as well. All right, but before we will do that, just just a quick think. Uh, Hello, before... everybody, and welcome back for another game. We need to try. All right, that's my video. If you want to <laughs> plug in light right there, uh, uh, just real quick, just just some uh, some historical things about this this game. When it was originally released, the Dragon Age, it was just so dark. It was just brutal, man. Everywhere was blood and everything went like... It, it, it was grim. And uh, yeah, we got the four minutes. Uh, everything was like grim and everything was dark. And uh, so when they renounced this trailer, there was a backlash as hell. I read the comments and they said, yeah, it's done. It, like Bioware is flat, like washed. That, that doesn't, you know, it, it's just it's just bad. And I can agree that uh, that it feels really different. I don't know what it will be game like gameplay wise. Maybe it will be different. It will be 
be great, but uh, for me it's just shift of, of the gameplay, and now I'm cautious about it, right? I'm like, what the hell, this is, this is different. But I don't say it's bad, because it can be really good, uh, but maybe they should release it as absolutely different game than the Dragon Age. Uh, but maybe they will surprise us, they will just go back uh, to the roots, they check out the games before and they were like, yeah, th this is the core thing that we went for before. And But maybe they want to aim for the different like age group and not for the people that really grew up with the Dragon Age. So uh, that would make sense, right? The Fortnite graphics, the, the cartoony thing. Like, it it's pleasing to watch, but it's a different vibe. So yeah, let's go. Let's go check it out the the gameplay, and this will be what it uh, what it make it or break it. But I will play. I have to say, even before the gameplay, I see. Uh, I will check it out. I don't want to be the one that like that uh, that uh, you know doomer. Uh, like yeah, this sucks because I have anticipated ten years something and it's different and I anticipated, so it sucks. I don't want to be that guy, right? I want to be the guy who fresh to that and and check it out and see if it's good or not because that's what I'm doing I'm checking a lot of games so this will not be a different one so let's go check it out the gameplay shall we all right three two one let's go be good please be good this is your first look at Dragon Age the whale guard Following footage was captured from software in development and take place very early in the game. It has been edited but able to avoid any major spoilers. Alright, that's what we like. Oh, Nev's as good at finding people as you claim. She's the best damn detective I've ever met. If she says she's got a lead on Solus, I believe her. Let's give the... Do we have... Oh, okay. There's no... Should we be in more of a hurry to get out of here? All right. We don't want to look it, it is different than the trailer. Nice casual. Find Nev Gallus, we have... Solus. Subtitles. And let's go with the English, right? Rook. One rogue. Backstory. Shadow dragons. Custom appearance. All right. So it's like dragon, uh, like uh, dragons. You still think you can talk him down before he starts his big ritual? Like divinity, that we can choose different characters as a starting the ones. The only thing separating us from the fade and an endless number of demons. I have to talk him down. But so far, and it's not. It's different than the. I didn't do anything. Than the trailer, so I'm I'm glad about that. Are they after us? Is it because of the bar? Word travels fast in Minrathus. We've got to help her. We don't have time to get arrested, especially in this Alright, this looks sick. I would love to know where this game will be like. Located. The ritual started, but if we hurry, we can still stop Solus before it finishes. Let's go. God damn, Solus! All right. This way. She'll get us to Dumont Plaza. Watch out! I want to see the combat. <laughs> Ooh, kind of different demons. Okay. Is Solus summoning demons on purpose? I guess it's Interesting. Isn't it not not like dark spawns, but really demons? When the veil comes down completely. The oh, let's go. Going to look a lot like this. Oh, that's a cool looking dude. What the hell? Come on, this way. It should get us to Harding. So it seems that there is like a climbing or something like that. They like got parkour. Oh yes. I don't know if that's an animation just because you reach it or you can climb on things. That would be different. You're safe now. Get inside and bar the doors quick as you can, okay? Thank you, miss. All right, scout. Yo, what's Hi. up? You all right? I've been doing what I can to help. The ritual must be weakening the veil. There are a lot of scared people out here. And a lot of demons. Haven't seen this many come through the fade in years. Legendary crossbow of Varric. What about you two? Are you okay? Hmm. Never better. 
a little shaky. Okay, in hurry. So, so, uh... We're good, but we need to move. That was uh, dialogue so options from uh, from the predecessor. Have you got my gear? Right over there. Like the simplify, like you can go this way, Where's this way, and Dallas? each of them going the different, like on, oh, no. you know, different emotion kind of. Before we arrived and paid off the bar owner to keep it quiet. I'm not surprised our detective did something to piss off a cult of murderous blood mages, but their timing stinks. The bar owner said the Venatori took Nev to Dumont Plaza. Can you get us there, Harding? Rook, you're with the Shadow Dragons. I figured you'd know Minrathis better than I do. Sure, but Minrathis is huge, and this is nowhere near my neighborhood. I can try. Don't worry. Scouting's my specialty. Follow me. All right, so so far I'm pleasantly pleased. Company. Like, the, the, the talking between characters feels natural. All right. Also co cool looking. Nice combat. Let's go. All right. So potions in the uh, in the left, the uh, arrows in the middle. I don't know what they are. Collecting gold. Okay. So looting is automatic. Right. He died. Oh, that was maybe from uh, destroying the pots. Oh, that's that's what it is. So you get eight arrows. And you can switch between uh, daggers or or swords and the bow, and you will um, replenish the, uh, the the arrows over time. That's the last of them. Good. Let's get to Dumont Plaza and find Nev. Oh, what that's the hell? Up if you need it. A lot of m a lot of mice. What is this? So you're getting potions out of pots because the pot is green. Okay, so they are really going for like action, you know, action heavy thing. They are going kind of from the RPG, right? Because if you have the pot that is green and you will loot it and you get green potion, that's like how how easier you can have it. Yeah, you can see there is another green pot. All right, you see the indication that someone is firing you. Okay, because you will be able to do a dodge. And, uh, and maybe they will implement the perfect dodges and everything. All right. So it's like in, in, the, in the areas, so you will have like area combat and you will go uh, forward. Yeah, they're really going for the action and not really for like RPG. <laughs> At least, uh, like from this snippet, it seems like that. It's not a bad thing, but it's different. But so far, art style is cool. I enjoy the art style. I was worried because of the trailer, but it's not like bright colors everywhere. It's kind of grim, right? Shadow, uh, it, it's kind of dark. Oh yeah, classic, right? <laughs> Slide down and there is the next arena. All right, you have new abilities. All right, tactic, pause. Interesting. All right, miss. That's okay. That happened to everyone. Like, I feel that, like, from the first one, the first Dragon Age was the most tactical of all. And and in the second one, they introduced, like, like the switch between the combats. Huge. Absolutely, like, really, really huge. And the third one, I felt there was something between, like... It was action, uh, but like dialed down from the second one, and uh, and uh, this one it feels like uh, we we lean into that even more. So it's even more action combat. Only thing that I'm worried right now it will be so linear. It will be like you will go from the from the place to place. You will just combat, 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 finish, and you will go for a different mission. And it will feel linear. Not cool. the worst timing. Mm. Nev, Ice man. Okay. So good to see you. We thought the had cool hat. You. 
They thought the same thing. Is it the wand the or the dagger? Figured I'd play along. I definitely wanted to settle the score this time. Interesting. Something between. The sky started raining demons. So I'm back on the job. Appreciate it. Rook, this is Neb Gallus, our local expert. She's gonna help us find Solus. Maybe. Neb, meet Rook. Both of you have done some work for the Shadow Dragons. Isn't that a coincidence? Some old friends said if I was working in Tevinter, the Shadow Dragons are worth trusting. We haven't got a lot of time. Varric said you had a lead on Solus. You get right to the point. So your your character is not voiced. Was it like that? He clicked and he doesn't say anything. Okay. I haven't seen Solus in person, but I did find hints of old magic, similar to what you get in Elven ruins. I don't know if the the guy, like the the custom made guy, Rook, is like character that we will create or we using the characters from the companions that we can be and we're just choosing different ones this ritual is already drawing more power than i'd expect from a dozen mages you told me he was working alone i also told you he was an ancient elven god an elven god well whatever he is he's causing trouble in my city oh yeah let's go and what he does all right the scenery looks good Still, the team discovers Solas hideout and Oluin Gate, the portal he used to escape the city of Minotaurus. They step through the gate. Alright, they're skipping the parts. <laughs> but that there could be really skip like that, right? They they finish the thing and they're like eh. <laughs> be somewhere else. And there's your ritual. The power involved. I've never seen anything like it. All right. Quite spectacle. The tremors are getting worse. And we've got demons. Yeah, those guys look awesome, I have to say. So they got a different kind of like HP bars. One got shield. And one had the swirling thing. Now I'm like, they, they are, are they like weak, uh, weak spots? Like, for example, for the shield you have to use a heavy attack, and for something you have to use a magic attack. I don't know. Or is it like specialization? So tank is like, uh, you know, more tanky thing, and the, and the swirling thing is a mage. So for you to recognize who is what, for example, the, the archers would have the arrow, right? And you would need, uh, you would know what they, the what you can expect from they them, kind of. This close to the ritual, no telling what could come through. Does it feel like those tremors are getting worse? Keep moving and try not to think about it. The team battles they were deep in the Athenum forest until they arrive at Solo's ritual site. All right. Ooh, big boy. Pride yeah, demon. This demon quickly. Applies weakened. Static. And uh, one charge. So again, he got two of them. He got the blue. Oh, that's that's kind of be like a magic barrier. Ah, oh, okay, that's a magic barrier and armor. Right. And you're consuming the magic barrier when then will go out. All right, you will go for armor and then go for health. Okay, makes sense. Quick recovering. Okay. Good jump. So you got two blips. That means that you can go for the for the attack or two of them. Under the abilities, there is the bar. So you have only three abilities. That's kind of like, I don't know. Like, what what will be the, the build variety? You have only three abilities. I understand there will be some passives to it, right? So you will power up those. 
But of course, they are trying to go for PC and console. And on consoles, you have four buttons. <laughs> so kind of you have to go for that. Otherwise, you have to press button and you have under four. And it's like, kinda, yeah, that's too much maybe for people. <laughs> uh, or maybe uh, through this, you will be changing between those three buttons. I don't think so. That will be the case. Everyone all right? Good enough. Let's get to Solus. They will not show Solus. Oh, nice. Smack. Oh, there he is. Is, is he? Shoot! <laughs> Ooh. Take it from here. Oh. Are you sure? Positive. You three just keep the demons off me while I talk to him. Varric, Solus isn't gonna stop just because an old friend asks nicely. Solus needs someone to sell him another option to help him justify changing his mind. All right. You can do it. This is a mistake. Come on, Varric. We didn't come all this way just to talk to him. Oh, okay. He was my friend, Rook. I gotta try to reach him. But if he won't listen to me, then he'll hear from Bianca. All right, Bianca is the crossbow. More demons. All right. So now it will be time event, and we will be protecting War Warwick. Rook, take care of the team for me. All right, let's. He can try. Chuckles. Hope I'm not interrupting. Oh, there he is. There he is. Right, jump down. Right. Let's buy him some time. All right. So back to the action. I hope Derek is getting through to Solus. We better talk fast. We can't hold these demons up forever. Like, so, so far, it's really action waste, but I, I don't kind of don't mind. I want to see how how the RPG mechanics will be there, right? What is the upgrade system? Because I can see that you will not be able to collect loot. I can see that. You will not be able to change your appearance. I can see all of those things that they will lean into and and it will be just like go through this and they will just forget the the RPG part kind of So hopefully not People are dying right now You need to listen All right Bianca talking Oh sh People are always dying. Bianca is dead? It is what they do. Shit. We need a better plan. Do you want me to take the shot? Won't work. He's too powerful. What if we disrupt the ritual? How? See those statues? If we break the scaffolding holding that one up, the whole thing will come down on Solus. It's risky. Interrupting a ritual at this scale will have consequences. And what about oh. the demons? Varric needs us to hold them off. Right. You two stay here. I'll bring down the statue. What? All right. Cool. Stepping into all that raw magic is suicide. Oh, that's the maybe a plot twist. Right? Anyone got a better idea? That he will get the power. Fine. But you'll need backup. I'm with you. I'm a mage. I'll go. Either way, someone needs to stay back and deal with the demons. Hmm. Choose wildly your decision will impact your companions. Harding greatly approves. Let's go, Hardy. Nev, keep the demons off us. You got it. Okay. Hey, you 
Oh yeah, that's a climbing mechanics. All right. That fall of the rubble was kind of like janky. Left. <laughs> oh, that feels weird. Okay. Oh my god, no way. <laughs> Why? Why tear down the veil? Knowing all the lives it'll cost. We shared a journey years ago. Do you believe that I would do this if there was some other better option? The pillar's weak, but. It isn't falling. We need to push it. I'm with you. And so now, we will be clicking button real fast. A long way and made a valiant effort, Varric, but this story does not end with my downfall. Oh, 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 oh okay. It's going down. You better run. All right, and now what Rarik will do? Ooh. Oh, he completed it. Okay. And that's it? We'll be the talking about this. No, that's it. So that's a gameplay reveal for you. All right, so that was like 15 minutes uh, of somewhere at the beginning. I have to say, it's not that bad. Like, the action combat is worrying me, kinda. <laughs> I like, where is the RPG aspect? They saw, you, we saw one UI clip that the, choosing the abilities, right? We saw that we get three abilities in maximum and we just using some blips to activate them. So there is no like mana or something like that. Uh, so you will be like focused on uh, dealing damage, right? Going in, doing damage, uh, recharge this, this, um, this uh, power action or something like that and you will be using those abilities at least that seems like that the 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 tone of the game is not bad like the, it was kind of like gritty even though it was not like dragon age one themed but um if i've caught like if you go and watch the trailer and you will see the gameplay there is a really big difference in those so we are not going with really like cartoony uh cartoony style game so that that's that's good i i like that i i kind of more lean with dragon age into the more realistic approach kind of but there is still a lot of mysteries about the game, right? Because they will release more information in the future. Uh, but I'm not down, right? I'm not like I've watched this 15 minutes. I'm like, yeah, Bioware is done. This is this is horrible. They should like end the game. This is this is bad. So I'm like optimistic that it could still could be uh, it still could be a really good game. But we have to see what what scope of the game, how linear it is, what what is the story behind this, and and so much more. But that will be for another time. For now, I feel um, yeah, I'm I'm cautious but optimistic. <laughs> But, uh, in the end, before I will end the video, I just wanted to tell you that on Thursday, this Thursday, so in two days, on 13, I will be starting um, the playthrough of the Dragon Age, and I want to go through one, two, to three before this will be released. So if you haven't played Dragon Age yet, and you would love to see the story before uh, the, the fourth will be here and, uh, you know, to know who is Varric, who is Harding and, and see those characters because few of those characters or Solas, uh, they were included in those three um, predecessors. So you will know and understand more about the lore. Uh, you can join me 
and here on YouTube, here on my YouTube channel, or on Twitch. So I will be streaming this game, and uh, we will see. And then I will for sure go for Dragon Age the Whale Guard, or Dragon Age for... Uh, uh, how you like it. So yeah, that's it from me today. Thank you very much. If you want don't want to miss out any more videos uh, hit the subscribe button um, And uh, stop by on Thursday to to play through the Dragon Age and have some fun. All right. Thank you very much And I will see you next time. Peace